Takwimu zinaonyesha ya kwamba Mkenya wa kawaida hunywa angalau chupa 42 vya vinywaji visivyolewesha kila mwaka lakini wasilojua ni kwamba vinywaji hivi vina madhara kwa afya. Madhara yanayotokana na unywaji wa soda hayawezi yakapuuzwa. Kwani vinywaji hivi vinasababisha uzani wa kupita kiasi, ugonjwa mifupa, kisukari na maradhi ya moyo. Diabetes and this is very critical each of you should know that. Hypertension, arthritis, heart disease, stroke, fatty liver disease, tooth decay. In fact many people who go to the dentist it's not because of sweets, it's just because of the extra soft drinks they take. Certain cancers, gallstones, breathing problems such as obstructive sleep apnea and many others. The list is essentially endless. Chupa hizi 42 zinavyonyweka na mkenya wa kawaida ni sawa na gramu 1638 ya sukari au vijiko 392 vya chai. Vile vile, mtu anapokunywa chupa moja ni sawia kuongeza nusu kilo ya uzani. So what happens when you drink a soft drink? Generally about half an hour after taking a soda, the blood sugar spikes up, causing the insulin which is produced by the pancreas to go up. And this burst of insulin tricks your liver into converting your sugars into fat. And of course you don't want to be fat just because of your unhealthy lifestyle. Aidha unywaji wa soda imehusishwa na mshtuko wa moyo, ugonjwa wa mifupa na ugonjwa wa figo au kipenda kidney stone formation. Hata hivyo, kuna vinywaji mbadala ambavyo vinaweza kukata kiu yako bila kusababisha madhara ya kiafya, kwa mfano glasi ya maji au sharubati ya matunda, chai au kahawa baridi zisizo na sukari au maziwa yaliyo na mafuta ya ngombe ya kiwango cha chini. Idadi kubwa ya watu hawapendi maji kwa kuwa hayana utamu. Hata hivyo unaweza ukaongeza matunda yenye sukari kama vile machungwa au ndimu miongoni mwa matunda na majani mengine. Matunda haya yanaboresha maji hayo kwa kuongeza vitamini. Hivyo basi kila unapotaka kunywa soda kumbuka umuhimu wa afya nzuri. Melissa Hanef K24 makala ya Rai Mwilini.